34, 24, 34 and a half. 105 pounds, 5 feet 3 inches, 19 years old. Her ambition is to improve herself. Representing Filipino community in Los Angeles, California, Lisa Manibo. Candidate number two, Elizabeth Dumagin. 85, 61, 85, or 32 and a half. Candidate number 15, Maria Isabel Lopez. 88, 61, 88. 110 pounds, 5 feet 3 and a half inches, 22 years old. 15th candidate for Figueroa de Oro, Maria Isabel Lopez. Candidate 23, Maria Lourdes Apostol, 87, 66, 87, or 34, 26, 34. 120 pounds, 5, 8, 18 years old, from Pampanga. Candidate number 24, Maria Lourdes Briones, 87, 61. She wants to be a successful woman in every way. Our 32nd candidate from Manila, Maria Virginia Anderson. Candidate number 33, Nanette Cruz. Nanette measures 92, 64, 92, or 36, 25, 36. She weighs 120 pounds and 5 feet 5 inches. Nanette is 19 years old. She aims to become a recording artist in the future. Our 33rd candidate from Tondo, Manila, Nanette Cruz. Candidate number 34 is Rowena and stands 5 feet 6 inches. Tina is 16 years old. Candidate number 36, Maria Desiree Verdadero. Desiree measures 87, 61, 87, or 34, 24, 34. She weighs 112 pounds, 5 feet 6 inches. Desiree is 19 years old. Dreams of becoming a successful fashion model. Candidate 35 and a half, weighs 116 pounds, 5'5 five, five and a half inches tall, from Pampanga. And number 38 is Gina Vinduan. 81, 58, 84, or 32, 23, 34. 104 pounds, 5, 4 and a half inches tall. Gina is 17 years old. Catalina swimsuit from Plaza Fair. Right now, we're ready for more special awards. We're giving special awards for Miss Photogenic, Miss Friendship, Miss Talent, and Best in Swimsuit. I'm sure you have your own candidate for Best in Swimsuit, too. We have more special prizes to be awarded, and we'll begin with Miss Photogenic, chosen by the press photographers themselves. Half of them are here tonight, and I think they're doing more judging. Give the award. Miss Photogenic is contestant number one. Lisa Manibo. A Taurus, the ball. Her hobbies are dancing, reading, gymnastics, and swimming. Speaks English and Spanish. She is second year college, University of South California. She already won the Miss Monterey Park 1980 and Miss Binibining Beating Filipinas USA 1981. Our Miss Photogenic contestant number one, Lisa Manibo. Miss Friendship, this is the. Um, it's also contestant number one, Lisa Manibo. To give the award is the impeccably beautiful Miss Foss, Rita Gomez. <laughs> Best in swimsuit, Lisa. <laughs> Number nine, Tolentino, Chris Teta. Number 14, Estrella Bonafé. Number 12, Feliciano Johnny. Number 18, Oxiones Annabelle. Number 19, Francisco Lynn. Number 20, Salas Janet. Number 23, Apostol Maria Lourdes. 
number 26, Ocampo, Gina. Number 27, Kino, Annalisa. Number 28, Hugh, Sharon, Georgina. Number 33, Cruz, Nanette. Number 34, Burden, Rowena. Number 38, Vin Luan, Gina. Number 36, Verdadero, Desiree. Usually, we only have 15 semi-finalists, but I told you tonight, and this year we have 17, so there are two more. Number 22, Borja Maria Concepcion. And our last semi-finalist, number 15, Isabel Lopez. And now, ladies and gentlemen, our 17 semi-finalists. Thank you, girls. Ladies and gentlemen, a big hand to our other contestants. Ladies, our 17 semifinalists are now going to make their traditional quarter turn. Dito ginagamit ang mga motorized drive at saka mga naked nyo kailangan mabilis dahil pag hindi nag-recharge ka agad, sorry na lang. Okay. Oh. Another quarter turn to the right. Now. This is what we call the view from behind. The scenes. <laughs> Another quarter turn to the right. Now. Yan mga side view. Diyan nakikita ang talagang gifted. Yung may mga future o wala. <laughs> and face our audience now. There you have it. Our 17 semi-finalists, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, my name is Maria Isabel Lopez from Manila. Okay. We'd like to call on Mr. Alphonse Muzon to uh, give the first question. Why not? It's already 1982. It's about time that women now learn independence, how to go on their own. Ang ganda ng pangalan na Dutch sa atin, KKB. Hi, I'm Gina Binjuan. To ask the question is Mr. Edgardo Espiritu from Metropolitan Bank. Candidate now. Uh, cooking is very delicious, especially if you, if you cook delicious, your husband will uh, appreciate it, that's all. What kind of dishes do you cook? Pinak bet. Pinak bet. Do you find it effective? Oh, yes. <laughs> okay, thank you very much. Contestant number 38. Number 33 now. We have Mr. Edward Neville Isdell to ask the question. Name, please. I'm Lynette Cruz, representing mm -hmm. Toronto, Canada. In your... Uh... The Canadian people and sharing all the Canadian ways with our, my fellow uh, Filipino. Thank you. Thank you. We have ah, a... one for the road. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> Elvira Manahan to ask We are Maria Annalisa yeah. Hila, and I'm representing Metro Manila. Yes. Yes, dear. If they asked you to pose for Playboy, would you? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I don't In spite of Polly Cayetano, whatever her name is. Yes. <laughs> would you? I don't think so. Why? Huh? Yeah, it's not my type. <laughs> really? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> That's contestant number 27. Ganyan dapat wag kayong kakabahan. Contestant number 23. Name, please. Hello, I'm Maria Lourdes, a postal from Pampanga. To ask the question is the Vice Consul uh, General Vernon Mechanic. I'm Maria, 
Oh, scrutinize everything. <laughs> Dangerous. I don't like that. <laughs> 23. Okay, we call the number 19. Number 19. Name, please. Good evening. I'm Lynn Francisco representing Metro Manila. No, la got <laughs> Miss Rita Gomez to ask the question. <laughs> Why do you say that, Ariel? I ask a, a very uh, a, a simple question. I stand corrected. Here is a simple question from Miss Rita Gomez. Number 19, if you had your druthers, what would you rather be, sexy or intelligent? Of course you can be both, but very, very few women are. Intelligent, because being sexy won't get me anywhere. I'd rather <laughs> plan You don't life. know what you're saying! <laughs> being sexy wouldn't get you anywhere? No, I don't mean that. What I meant was, being intelligent would last me longer for my whole life. Uh, I mean. In this world, you meet really the smart ones, like Rita Gomez. You should be able to stand on your own. Girls, you're doing very well this year. I'm proud of you. Okay. Number 12. Hindi ko alam kung saan maganda siyo, kung dito sa baba eh. Sa bagay, mahirap talaga maka-eksena ang mga Rita Gomez. Okay, number 12. My name is Mary Joan Feliciano, and I come from Manila. John, he's Mr. Harold Hoffman, president my, of Cargo. My name is Harry Hoffman. I come from Laguna. <laughs> <laughs> Elvira Manahan said if you would go to her office, I understand that you don't want to go there. If I invite you to go to my office, will you come there? It depends. But if I invite you very sweetie, very sweetie, will you come there? It still depends. <laughs> I like your, on your bank book, I like your challenge. I accept it. Thank you. <laughs> thank you very much. And thank you, Mr. Hoffman. Contestant number nine. Valentino. And contestant number one. <clears throat> A very good evening to all of you. My name is Lisa Maniborg and I represent the United States. From Philippine Jaycees is Mr. Victor Luciano. Well, <laughs> I believe that, of course, I always want to be respected, and if I were treated as that such on the first day, I would assume that he didn't quite respect me as much as I would hope, the impression uh, I gave. Lisa, 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 I, I, I will read a question to you again. Mm -hmm. The question is, would you respect a man who did not make a pass at you on your first date? In other words, oh. torpy. <laughs> well, pardon me for not interpreting the question right. Yes, uh, well, I'll tell you. Maybe you can answer. If someone didn't make a pass at me, I think I'd appreciate it a lot more. If someone did make a pass at me, well, I'd tell him where he stood. Okay, thank you very much. Number one, number 20. Name, please. Good evening, I'm Janet Salas from Metro Manila. Thank you, Janet. Again, you're lucky, Janet, because once again, here is Miss Rita Gomez. Janet, would you be honest if someone were to ask you if you were a virgin or not? Yes, why would I hide it? Are you? Yes, I am. On television? Yes, <laughs> thank On you. On television. <laughs> thank you very much, Janet. How about you, Rita? Hi, <laughs> <laughs> didn't you hear them say that I had five children? What did you think I had five immaculate conceptions? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Miss Rita Gomez. Number 22. Buenas noches. I'm Maria Concepcion Borja from Sambuanga City. It's a nice place. Sambuanga, how's the weather down there now? It's all right. That's very good. We have Mr. Mechanic to ask you a question. You know what the uh, panel thinks of you because you're one of the 17 finalists. What do you think of the panel? <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, I think the panel is uh, really good in uh, choosing the semi-finalists. They chose those who really deserve it. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much, number 22. Now, number 36. 
Lucky girl. <laughs> Hello, I'm Maria Des Riverdidero from San Pedro, Laguna. Okay, I, I, I was told that in Laguna it's very cool. Is it cool in Laguna now? Not so. It's going to be a little bit warmer when Elvira Manahan asks you a question. Desiree, what makes you angry? Well,